This video is designed to be a guide. Please note that other complications may exist that aren't addressed in this guide. While we always strive to provide accurate and detailed information, we can't guarantee that it will fix your TV's issues. Shop Jimmy is not responsible for any harm that you may cause to yourself or damage to your TV during the repair process. Try all repairs and troubleshooting at your own risk. Be sure to take all the proper safety precautions. In this video we will show how to upgrade the firmware for the following SKU. SJ A-2037 dash 764 dash A. Updating the firmware is required when replacing this main board. The firmware update should be done immediately after installing the board. In order to install the firmware update, go online and download the software from the Sony website. Then put the software onto a USB flash drive and then stick that USB flash drive into the TV. We will start by showing the process for obtaining the software, extracting it, and copying it to the USB flash drive. Obtain a USB flash drive that has a capacity of 250 megabytes or more. Connect the flash drive to a computer so that it can be formatted. Formatting the flash drive will erase everything that is currently on it. Format the drive as FAT32. Click the link in the description for directions on formatting in FAT32. Once the USB drive is ready, download the file. Go to eSupport.Sony.com. Click on the Drivers and Software button. Enter your TV model number and click Go. Scroll down and click on the Firmware tab. Click on the Download button. On the next page, click Download Now. Read and accept the user agreement. After clicking on Accept for the agreement, the download should automatically begin. After it begins, click the Back button to go to the previous page. On this page, you can scroll down and read various information about updating the firmware. It is crucial that you read the important notes section on this page. Also, if you need further instructions, you can click on the links that are shown on this page. Once the file has completed downloading, go and find the zip file, extract the contents of the zip file per the instructions on the Sony page based on your operating system. In this video, we are using one of our test TVs. This test TV has a cracked screen, 
but we need to use it for the video. Please excuse the fact that the cracks might hide some letters or words from the words that are showing up on the TV screen. Completing the firmware update will not fix the cracked screen. After you have replaced the main board, you can insert the USB flash drive into the TV. Then go ahead and plug in the TV. Power on the TV using the remote or key controller. Be sure the TV has powered on so the update will automatically take place. There are different scenarios and symptoms that your TV can show. You may have an image on the screen, you may not. You may get a blinking light, or you may not. Here are a few scenarios we have seen. If you have an image on the screen, follow the prompts. If you have an image on the screen, but the image is upside down, Continue to follow the prompts to complete the update, and this should fix the problem. One scenario is if the power light on the TV is blinking, alternating colors of amber and green. We have seen this happen with an image on the screen and also without an image on the screen. Wait six minutes for the update to complete. The TV should restart itself after the update has completed. If you are receiving a message on the screen that shows that there is no update needed as there is no new software available, then you do not need to do this update.